Hey, it's Keith Brown, and I'm building my own electronics, believe it or not. Uh, long story short, I saw a video on YouTube, and uh, I recently got back into RC airplanes, and I saw a guy that was flying his airplane with a camera in the pilot seat, and he was actually moving his head, and the camera was responding. So he was actually flying the little airplane, but it was like he was flying the airplane himself, first person. I thought that was great. Let me get that system. It was fourteen hundred dollars. I was like, yeah, forget that. So did a little bit more research and he said, hey, yo, use this accelerometer. I was like, okay, I'll use this accelerometer. Well, how am I going to plug it into my transmitter? I don't know. So I got the Due Milanova. Long story short, it's Italian, and um, I put an accelerometer on there. I I looked up all the information on the accelerometer where the pins go, what they do, how they do what, plugged it into the appropriate pins on the Arduino and my prototype shield, a couple of servos, accelerometer, some software, I'm all done. And the best part is, after you program it using your USB, you can just simply plug a battery into the battery port and it's self-sufficient. So guess what? Put it anywhere you want. You tap into the battery of the remote control airplane and it does what you need it to do. Uh, let me show you Look at this so this is what I did I created my own little software here as you can see I calculated the g-forces and translate that into angles and those angles I'm transmitting to the servo arm of the servo from 0 to 180 degrees basically by moving my head 90 degrees Essentially, I can get 180 degrees of movement out of my servos. So you don't have to, like, move, you know, dislocate your neck just to try to make this thing work. You're like, yeah, yeah, write your own software, build your own electronics, yeah, great job. That's why you're doing this YouTube video to brag about what you can do. Hey, it's so simple. They have libraries set up in the software. It's done, basically. Let me show you exactly what it can do. microprocessor it's called the Arduino Due Milanovi. It's Italian.